Here we are at part 11 of my video walkthrough for Mega Man X. And it's time to head back into Sigma's Fortress, level 2. Yeah, this, this part right here is a little tricky. You gotta be careful as you're jumping around here so that the bats don't knock you off these ledges. You could use the rolling shield if you're real worried about it, that way you'll just kill the bats if they run into you, but if you're fast, you'll be alright. Work our way through here. Alright, we already reached the boss door. It's time to fight Chill Penguin again. Although this time we can use his weakness on him, the Flame Wave. Yeah, I love how it catches him on fire. Yeah, you can also use. Aw, oh, didn't jump quite right there. You can use the flame wave to destroy his little ice penguins like insanely fast, so. If you're interested in doing so. Yeah, your blizzard doesn't do much if you don't have any ice penguins out. Aw, oh, he still froze me. <laughs> didn't angle that just right. Oh! Hate it when he does that. Alright, you're trying to be annoying. This is another good reason for fighting him like first, is because he's not really much easier with his weakness than when he is with just the buster. But he's dead now. Alright, Sigma, I'm gonna get revenge on you. You killed Zero! <laughs> See, that's why those guys should always be inside their armor. Because now we just stole it. Oh, I love getting to use the robot ride armor. It's just awesome. I believe this one was called the Chimera. Because uh, in one of the later ones, you get like different kinds of robot ride armor. So, Alright. Now we have two paths we can take on this side. We can take the left side or the right side. Um, if we use the rolling shield, though, it makes the right side really easy. So... There we go, because all the bullets will hit you and they won't do nothing, and you can kill all the enemies. And and here we have our second boss that we have to fight in here. It's Storm Eagle. Oh, we get to use his weakness on him, too. He's weak to the Sting Chameleon, or the Chameleon Sting. So, yeah, you should be able to tear him up really fast. Chameleon Sting does a lot of damage anyway. Ah, so, oh, this dude's just getting melted. Aw, oh, didn't get him that time. There we go. You guys are nothing to me. Sigma's the one I'm after. I'm here for revenge! Alright, now see how that guy's situated? There's no real good way to, like, hit him. The way he's, like, angled. So what I opt to do is a charged up storm tornado, because it goes vertically. That way you can like hit him underneath while he's like throwing his thing toward you off the wall. That's what I found to be the easiest way to kill these guys. Bam! A few more enemies to take out here. We don't have any more mini bosses, so it's time to just take on the boss. Now, I'm not sure what the name of this boss is, but I always just referred to it as The Room. It's a giant face on the back wall here, and uh, the eyes will open up, and depending upon the color of the eye, it affects what they do. The green one shoots a bullet at you, the blue one slides at you, the red one will shoot three bullets, and then uh, after a bit of time, the walls will pinch together and the nose will try to attack us. Um, you want to kill the eyes first before trying to kill the nose. Because if you kill the nose, the walls will stay pinched in like this, and you'll have to try to fight the eyes while sliding on the walls, because if you notice, there's a spike pit down there. We do not want to run into that. Instant death spikes. Not very much fun for a boss fight. So just uh, try to dodge the nose, work on taking the eyes out. Sting Chameleon will blow them up really fast. And uh, once we are left with just the nose, uh, well, I like to use this Storm Tornado. Because uh, this boss is 
very often above or below you, so a vertical attack just hits him extremely well, puts us in a low ri danger risk. Um, I don't think he's weak to it, but it, it's just the easiest thing to hit him with it, and it does fairly good damage, so... It's the safest way to fight this guy. I forget what he's actually weak to, but I don't think it's anything that you'll like, most likely kill yourself trying to hit him with it, so... There we go! We have defeated the room.